New exercise for pooch belly. All right, what are we doing down here, Steph? <laughs> okay, so I'm lazy and I didn't want to get up because this feels kind of good. So you're laying on a foam roller. I am. Okay, and it's along your spine, under your head, under your tailbone? Yes, it's All very right. supportive and it's quite comfortable, what's actually. The, what's the movement? What's the exercise here? Okay, well, this is a little bit more of an advanced version um, that's going to require some balance, but that's good because it will actually stimulate the core to turn on. So I'm going to place my arms out to the side. Palms up or down? Uh, palms up's a little bit harder, so let's see if we can do this palms up. And I'm gonna bring my legs up to a tabletop position. Okay, now from this position, with my spine in neutral, there's a little gap there. I'm gonna remove that gap. So I'm gonna roll my pelvis back. Oh, so you're flattening right I'm down into I'm flattening, the... and this is giving me some good feedback so that I know it's making contact now, with my Now when you do spine. this, you feel this, you feel your abs contract. Yes, Okay. yes, so I'm taking out that pelvic tilt. Now I'm gonna flex my feet, and on an exhalation, I'm gonna slowly tap one heel down while maintaining my spine flat against the foam roller. So you're keeping, you're keeping everything against the foam roller, no arch in the low back, keeping the knees bent, and then you're flexing your feet, that means you're bringing your toes back. That's why, that's why your feet look funny right now. That's why my feet look funny and my toes are spread. But what I'm trying to do is draw my navel down as I exhale the leg down. So as you go down, you're trying to squeeze down even more into yes. the foam roller. Yes, so if I were to relax my stomach, you'd probably just see everything pop up, mm -hmm. right? Oh yeah, big difference there. That's where you wanna be. So what is this doing here? What are we activating here while you're doing this movement? We are activating the TVA, so once you've isolated it and you begin to strengthen it, now you wanna see if you can stabilize and activate it while the legs are moving. Because against the weight of my legs and the pull of my psoas, it's making it even harder for my core to work. Okay, so the key of this movement again, just to reiterate, keep everything tight down, flat against the foam roller, knees bent, feet flexed, and you go one at a time and just tap the floor and come back up. Yes. If you wanna make it more difficult, I'm assuming you straighten the leg out a little bit. Exactly, so easier is tapping the heel very close to the glute. Harder is going to be to maintain that spine pressing down, navel drawing down. Oh yeah, and I can see that, much more difficult. And extending the leg out. Excellent movement, I've actually done this once before. Um, it's much more difficult uh, than it looks. I'm pretty sure you've got a nice little a little burn going, little, little it's good. Core burn there. Um, subscribe to this channel. We post a new video every single day. Also, mindpumpmedia.com. If you go there, check out our 30 days of coaching for free.